Hey my little nightmares, welcome back to a new video. I know it's been a while and I've been really dying to show you this. I got this in a few days ago. I haven't been able to make a video then when I first got it because I've been busy and I haven't had the chance to make a video. But I only suggest this to somebody who knows what their knife uh, rules or bands are, what's allowed and what's not allowed basically. My state allows this, allows daggers, bowie knives, and there's no length limit. And this is 8 inches. The blade itself is 8 inches. Now, here's the box it came in. It has the cyclone on the top. It says M48 on the side. Here it is in the sheath. And that's a pretty nice long dagger. Now, I've seen this thing tested out. There it is. I've seen people even use, uh, the ones on YouTube, actually use the sheath as a weapon. This is the way it's shaped. So, here's the blade. Well, I, I've tested this thing on a few uh, things, like water bottles and soda cans. I have yet to get a, like a realistic zombie head, or styrofoam head, to, uh, test this out on. You got the skull crusher on the end. I think what that's the cool thing about it. You get two weapons in one. You got one for stabbing and you got one for bashing. So I've seen this thing tested out. Three shot, three and two hits with this. It'll give you a concussion the first time and it'll go through the second or third time. This, any uh, full amount of power you use, it will go right through. It'll go right through. This will kill somebody. And it's not nothing to play with. It's why, kind of why, if you look up the history about these things, I don't know how you pronounce it. I've seen it called being a, jag, a jagged commando uh, knife. Unless it sounds different, but that's how I pronounce it. It's either German or something. My boyfriend told me about it. But only get this if your state allows it. And if you are allowed to carry it, like I do. I carry this around everywhere I go. The only places you can't carry this in are like school grounds, police stations, banks, etc. You can't carry them in there. But I can carry this like if I'm going to a walk in the park or something. But I want to show you this, guys. Go to Cutlery USA, order you one. It's $70 plus shipping. The four dollars is the shipping. The blade itself is seventy, but be sure to check. Or sometimes, uh, where you get it from, they'll check for you to see if your state allows it. If it doesn't, they won't ship it to you. Some places are known to do that. I think Amazon done that one time to somebody that they or something that they ordered. Watching the door. So I hope you guys like this video and this blade. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!